Hi everyone, I'm Mike from Wolfsburg Vans and we've got an exciting little project that we're going to film for you. It's called Shit to Shiny. So as you know, we sell customised vans. Everything we customise comes in basic. So this week, for example, we've had seven, eight vans delivered. Sometimes they turn up and they're in really good condition. Very occasionally, we'll get one turn up that is absolutely battered exterior-wise. Obviously, service history and, and mechanically, they're all fine, we make sure before we buy them. But we buy a lot online because we buy so many vehicles. I can't go and check them all. The lads can't go and check the, the, the vans out, every single van, so they just turn up. It doesn't matter to us because everything goes through our body shop anyway. But occasionally we'll get one and the paintwork will have dents, scratches, and marks in but loads of them so we have to paint paint the full van this is a prime example of one that's come in and it's got loads of damage on it bonnets knackered rear doors are knackered dents in the side scratches everywhere full van's going to need painting and it's silver so when this happens i get a little bit excited because i think color change and silver is great for doing a color change so we're going to paint it all anyway so we're going to completely change the color on this van and show you how we take it from shit to shiny. So if you just come over, I've marked in chalk, all the stuff that needs doing exterior wise on this. Bonnet's knackered, we'll put a new bonnet on that. That can't be saved. Come along the side, door needs sorting out. That's dented in, we can fix that. Dent man can fix that. We've got a dent, dent on the rear quarter. Now with silver as well, you can't just paint this panel you have to paint the full side. You can never blend silver in properly. So it's never, never going to be an option to just paint single panels. Even if it just had this on there, we would have to paint the full side. So even, even better that we're going to do a color change on it. So if you come around the back, keep up, George. Doors dented. Might be hard for you to see on the camera, which is why I've marked it out in chalk, but we've got a dent there, dent there. Again, dent man will get that out and then we're we'll be painting it. The bumper is absolutely knackered. Now obviously this has been, this has been a work van. It's done 97,000 miles, but it's got full service history. So every service has been done. It's been maintained well, but it has been a work vehicle and a lot of people do use them as work vehicles. So that clearly has had things being pulled in and out, been used for what it, it's a van. It's been used for what it was intended. So, you know, it's, it, it's, it's not been cherished, it's been used, it's been worked, it's earned someone some money, hence all the marks on it. So it's not necessarily a bad thing that, you know, you'll see a lot of vans in this condition, just because we do caddies and we do high-end vans that you're used to seeing them pristine, but I'm going to show you that sometimes this is what they look like. Mark there, dent, 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 scratch, 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 dent, dent. Scratch and dent. So again, full side, absolutely battered. So we're gonna paint this a special color. I've wanted to do this color for a little while, so we're gonna paint it matte metallic yellow. So similar to yellow to the do that they do on the Audi R8, but a matte version of that. So you might be wondering why I think that this is a good fan for us to pump so much money into because this project's going to cost us a few quid and at 97,000 miles you might be thinking well the mileage is too high by the time you spent all that money on the paint and then doing all our usual Wolfsburg styling it'll be too expensive but it's got full service history it's a trend line it's got air conditioning it's got cruise control and there's no rips or tears in the seats so it, it's got it's got everything that you need really um air con being one of the big things and cruise control. Welcome to, welcome to Hyde. <laughs> welcome to Manchester. So to reiterate, service history is up to date. Mechanically it's sound, looks tatty. It's gonna look fantastic when we've done it. It's got air conditioning, it's got cruise control. This is gonna make a fantastic van for someone. Okay, so Van's back from paint now. We changed the colour from the silver that you saw before to this lovely matte yellow. All the scratches, dents and marks are gone. So the full van has been painted and looks fresh. We've got gloss black roof and spoiler. Uh, gloss black mirrors, although we are going to change these mirrors. We're going to put the smaller Caddy Life mirrors on so 
um, they've just been delivered today and we're going to paint them. Uh, we'll show you them later, so they're not going to go on today. Gloss black 19 inch wheels and sidebars. Once they're on, that'll bring everything together. We put a GTI bumper on this like we did on our last colour change van. You would have seen the grey one. So we've done gloss grills, GTI custom bumper with gloss grills in that too. No splitter needed on these. Let's get it built up and show you what it's going to look like. Okay, so all the parts are on, wheels are on, bars are on and everything now. We're going to tune the vehicle. So we're doing some development anyway on our 2 litre TDI remap. So we thought it'd be a perfect opportunity to stick this on, on the rolling road um, and tune it and make that other video as well. So we're going to run it at first standard, see what the power it makes. If we know that it makes anywhere between 102 and 105, we know that the van's healthy, there's nothing up with it doesn't need a math sensor or anything um, and, and then we're going to tune it stage one and hopefully anywhere between 190 and 200 horsepower. Right, so stock it ran 105 horsepower, so we're happy with that. We know there's no problems with the van and it's not ran under power. And we just tuned it and ran it again and it ran 198.5, as you can see up on the graph there. So we're happy with that. Um, it's tuned now, it's faster, the torque smoothed out, you've got more confidence to overtake. That's this van done mechanically. So next step is onto Valet, where we're gonna get it all cleaned up and get it up for sale and hopefully somebody's going to buy it. concludes our shit to shiny video where we took the silver caddy that you saw before with lots of dents and marks and scratches on and we've repainted it in this lovely Audi R8 Vegas yellow but we've done it with a twist we've done it matte so matte paint work with all the gloss black bits on we're really happy with it it's been really enjoyable and fun to do and that's what we do here at Wolfsburg Vans we take vans and make them a bit special and this is one of the most special ones we've done today I would say going to be up for sale and on the website very soon we've had a few inquiries already so it'll probably be sold by the time this video goes out if you like these videos and what we're doing here at Wolfsburg give us a like and a subscribe on our YouTube or show us some love in the comments and we'll make more content for you